If you think the answer is five, you are absolutely wrong. Yeah, yeah, I know exactly why you might think that. You're probably thinking, oh, the fives cancel out, so 15 divided by three is five, right? That's exactly the common mistake almost everyone makes when they see this problem. It looks like magic, but nope, math has its own rules. And hey, my friend, only 99.5% of my viewers actually don't subscribe. Please consider subscribing. So let's come to the point. All right, here's the proper way to think about this. We have 15 divided by 3 over 5 times 5. First, remember PEMDAS, parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction. But here's the kicker. Multiplication and division are on the same level, so we process them left to right. Yes, left to right. Not just canceling numbers magically. Now, whenever we see a fraction and division, like divided by 3 over 5, it's often easier to flip it using the KCF rule. That's keep, change, flip. Keep the first number, change the division to multiplication, and flip the fraction. So 15 divided by 3 over 5 becomes 15 times 5 over 3. Let's do it carefully. Step 1, 15 times 5 over 3. Multiply 15 times 5 equals 75, and then divide by 3 gives 25. Step 2, now multiply by the last 5. So 25 times 5 equals 125. So the correct answer is 125, not 5. Yep, not 5. Surprising, right? If you don't believe it, try it on your calculator. And if you still have doubts, please write down in the comments. Thanks for watching.